EU members have stressed the need to develop a coordinated approach to vaccine certificates. A common EU approach to vaccination certificates is likely to reinforce the public health response in member states and the trust of citizens in the vaccination effort. The electronic vaccination certificates would show whether a traveller had been immunised against coronavirus before crossing borders. The system was a key part of discussions on how the bloc is going to lift pandemic restrictions over the coming year. Earlier, the World Health Organization advised against any such system. We heard from its representative. We generally advise not to do, make it mandatory. It's much better if people want to be vaccinated. If, if you have a mandatory system, it's much difficult to, much more difficult actually to ensure that everybody gets vaccinated because people then become frightened. And there's no reason to be frightened of something like this, which is a life-saving tool. We are a scientific and neutral co um, organization. Now, of course, like any organization, we do get criticized. But we also have noted there have been some politicization of the response. And we do ask, leave the politics out of this. Well, certainly we have been concerned and have been warning against vaccine nationalism for a long time. And again, that's why in parallel, while the scientists were working on developing the vaccines, we were working on setting up um, the facility, the COVAX facility, and talking with all the different countries to join that. We will see big changes. We will see big improvements in 2021 if we all keep doing what we must do, if we all play our part. Continue with the public health measures, continue with the tracking and tracing, finding every case, bringing the numbers down. As we bring the numbers of infections down and as we increase the vaccination, the virus will have nowhere to go.